Hey everybody, Bobby here with All Country News. Super excited as Brandon Ratcliffe. How are ya? I'm doing great. Great. Come on, yeah. You know what? And I learned something new about you. I didn't know you were so flexible. You just almost roundhouse kicked me in the face. I know, yeah. I, you know what? I worked on that for a good year of my life. That was part of my COVID project was to finally be able to touch my toes, you know? Oh my God. I can do it. Yeah, yeah. So the high kicks, you know. I, I love it. Yeah, there wow. you go. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed. So we're going to talk about your new album, which I'm super okay. excited about. Some Opry news that you have right. had. But before we do that, we have some really fun questions. All right, let's see. Do some just... have one, some have two. It's just really let's the luck see. of the draw. Let's go to the bottom here. Oh, yeah. Ooh, all right. What'd you get? What'd you get? Let's see. Anything good? Oh, boy. Most embarrassing store you might be seen shopping at. <laughs> you know, honestly, this is not a great question for me because I hate shopping. You do? I hate shopping. I okay. can't stand it. So In if fact, you have to shop, where would you, like, where would you oh, meander into if you absolutely had to? Do you know what I love? I love old hardware stores. Ooh, okay. You know, I like going to a nice old, specifically if it's local, but okay. even, even kind of like an Ace Hardware will work. Yeah. Uh, tractor Supply. Hey, Something love like that. that. I just look, there's something about the smell of those places, I and know. it takes me back. You know, it makes me that. feel like I'm at a feed store back in Cotton Valley, Louisiana, or something. I you love know, that. yeah. Are you handy, or is that you just I like am, the smell? I, I'm not handy <laughs> okay. at all, actually. Yeah, no, I, I, I wish I was more. My dad has to still come fix things for me. Okay, okay. I'll call, I'll call my dad if something's going wrong with my truck, because I still drive the only truck I've ever owned. I love that. And he can tell me more about the engine from 500 miles away than I can standing right in front oh my of the gosh. truck. You know? Thank God for dad. Thank God for dad. I love yeah. it. But you had a really big moment this year. You got to step into the Opry Circle. Chills. So talk to me about just kind of the lead up to that and just kind of some of those takeaways for you. For sure. Sure. Yeah, it was uh, surreal, uh, humbling. It was a beautiful night that I will yeah. never forget. It was my daughter's first show. Oh my god! So yeah, it was. Uh, I mean, a magical night. Uh, and then I also got to sing with my mom too, which is incredible because my mom it, was in a band growing up, and uh, it, I was around music my whole life. I and, love that. and I went to the Opry a ton with them. Uh, but never once did I think that I would be standing in that circle oh and she goodness. would be singing up there with me. So, uh, yeah, it was it was beautiful. Yeah, magic is like not even like I the know. right yeah, word. Yeah, you couldn't even, it was like a movie script, you know? Oh, I mean, my gosh. I love yeah. it. I love it. So, the new album, Tale of yes. Two Towns, Obsessed. Oh, it reminds me of you. Tale of Two Cities that I had to read in high yes, school. Yeah, yeah. There you go. <laughs> yeah, there you go. I love it. But talk to me about the choices on this album and why for these sure. songs for this album. Yeah, absolutely. So we wrote this record kind of like a book of my life. Really. I love that. Yeah. Um, and uh, it's just dealing with that, you know, hypothetical question of like, who would I be if I never would have left versus yeah. who am I today? Because I did. And all the questions along the way, you know, because uh, when you leave a town like mine, you know, um, you get to this place in life where you, because you left, you obviously didn't want to see a yeah. future there. Yeah. But you also, you know, getting closer to 30, you start having your own oh, family. Yeah. Oh, yeah. You start thinking about <laughs> some of the reasons why people might have stayed there. And so yeah. we're sort of just kind of dealing with all those questions on this record. And it. Uh, and it is sort of written like chapters in a book. I love so, that. Um, so, yeah. I, and I appreciate that you love it. But yeah. uh, it's it's the most personal thing that I've ever done. So I love it. Speaking of personal, I feel like was there a song that was hard to get out, hard to record, hard, hard to write? Was there maybe just one on the album that For you're sure. like, when you were done, you're just, <clears throat> Okay, we're done. Yeah, I mean, in hard in different ways because there was uh, Tale of Two Towns, the title track, yeah. was probably the most difficult song because it was the first song of that season of my life. It was the thing that sort of spawned the whole record. Yeah. Um, but it the reason why it was hard is because it came from such a vulnerable, real place. And a lot yeah. of times when you're writing songs, you're writing fictitious stories, or you're writing things that really have nothing to do with your life. Yeah, yeah. And when you sort of dare to say something that vulnerable, there is this weird feeling of like, you almost feel kind of uncomfortable. Yeah, you're like, like I don't know if I'm supposed yeah, to be yeah. able to say this, yeah. you know? And I remember when I sent it in, I felt that way. I was like, I don't know how people are gonna receive this, yeah. uh, if it's gonna be something negative or people are going to make people feel like, ah, oh, it's too personal. And it's been kind of the opposite. It's people have been, I've, it's the most, um, I've seen people jacked up about my music yeah. ever. Uh, and oh, I think yes. it's because it's that real. Yeah. And I think that's just something I love about the album. It's, it's very easy to plant yourself in those stories. Wow. I love that. Yeah. So what else are you excited for this year? Are we going, getting on the road? Are you going to come see us yeah. in Chicago? Oh, come on. Please have me in Chicago. Please. Yes. I'm trying. Yeah. Yes, please, please, please. <laughs> I'm trying to uh, get out as much as I can Great. and tour. Um, I've been in the middle of uh, the dad life for oh, a while I love, now. Hey, dad life's a great it's life. It's great. It's amazing. Yeah. Uh, but I'm very excited to get out and play these songs for people and uh, this whole record. And then also uh, get more music recorded and release the back half of this record. So, yeah. Well, I'm super excited. Yes. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank and uh, keep working on touching your toes. Let's go. Yeah. Right, I will. Thank you. <laughs>